time for a walkabout in the veggie garden. Compost bins over there. This is a potato bed, Yukon Gold potatoes. Plants look like they're doing very well. They're getting blown over by the wind. So in here we got more potatoes and at the back we've got peas. And over here raspberries. This, this bed has a couple of zucchini plants and the butternut squash. It's also got some uh, tomatoes growing in there which really shouldn't be in there. I've got to take them out. And over here strawberry bed with onions growing in between. Tomato plant over here. It has some tiny little Roma tomatoes growing on it. Bok choy over there on the big trellis. We've got Canada crookneck squash, butternut squash, and uh, yeah, and there's some things in the middle like oregano and stuff like that. <clears throat> A little bit disappointed. I think my butternut squash are not vining plants. They look like they're going to turn out to be bush plants, so they won't grow up the vine, up the uh, trellis rather. Here we have the garlic. I give that another couple of weeks probably before I harvest that. Leaves are starting to turn brown. We'll wait for uh, maybe another couple of leaves at the bottom to, to go brown before harvesting. Over here, we want to make a plant, some bok choy which, and a cabbage. So the insects and snails have been having a field day on these plants. You can see the full of holes. Some small pepper plants, kohlrabi got devastated by some animal, and there is uh, arugula. The new beds over here, looking pretty good. Uh, cucumbers in the back, growing nicely. There's a tomato plant. A couple of peppers with pepper plants with flowers on them. And nasturtiums and some carrots cabbage that's been totally devastated. And there's a basil in there. Back here we, on the second bed we have more cucumbers, another tomato plant, beans that have had been stripped of leaves. And again not too happy but they're flowering which is interesting. Some onions, carrots. This was a Chinese cabbage and again it's just been totally demolished. Uh, coming over here, rhubarb, uh, there's a couple of pumpkins, maybe too shady there for them, and uh, that's the horseradish. And we come to these beds that are surrounded by interlocking bricks, and uh, we have uh, at the back along the trellis we've got several varieties of tomatoes. This is kale, another cabbage that's been eaten, some carrots, onions, kohlrabi, oregano, basil, peppers, second bed, tomatoes, 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 basil over there, onions, carrots. This cabbage is starting to come along. It's good. My parsnips did not do well. Only got about five or six that sprouted. So I'm putting carrots in between them now. So that's pretty well it. Uh, over here, this is a flower bed, but we do have chives growing in here. And we have this big blackberry bush that we planted, small bush, uh, several years ago. It hasn't done anything, hoping this year we will actually get some blackberries off it. And then over there, of course, we have Michelle's Gardens.